Okay. Servo mechanical. Somebody wanted to see my hydrogen cell from my group on Yahoo, which is the Vortex Heat Exchanger group. Um, anyway, this is it. This is my cell. There's six inner and outer tubes in there with the leads that go up to the top. I'm hoping you can see this. I'll turn the light on. Hopefully that's a little better. So those are my leads. My pressure gauge. It's all done with this alternator right here. It's been gutted. Um, I took all the diodes out of it. There's three leads remaining. Um, I ran those up. They're AC. They go up to 200 volts. Put 12 volts in from a battery, which is over there. You spin this thing, which right now I'm using a one and a half horsepower motor. Um, really, it needs two to get the full 200 um, volts out of it because this thing will trip. It's just simulating a gas engine. So, if you're running this with a gas engine or trying to produce hydrogen with a gas engine, I'm not saying it could run one. Um, I'm just saying that uh, if you're running it with a gas engine, you would consume about two horsepower. Um, and it draws about one amp. So, off the battery. There's my bubbler. There's my diodes, there's my connections, there's my charging chokes, and I'm going to fire it up. So, oh, let me show you the front. This is the front, all my little controls and gauges and gadgets and gizmos here that I, when I built this. Um, on the back, you'll see there's two pots. Those are rheostats. That's to control the voltage. Um, one controls, no, I mean, both of them control the, uh, 12 volts going into the alternator so I can control the output. The more volts I put in, up 0 to 12, I get up to 200 volts AC out, convert it back to DC, and then run my cell. So, I'm going to fire it up. Be patient with me, please. There you go. See my amps. It's not a very good amp gauge, but right now it looks like I'm running about maybe two, three amps. Hopefully you can see that. I don't know. Anyway, that's it. It's really going down. Why don't know? Ice cold. Oh, cold. Ice cold. 
step. That's my cell. And shut it down. She's still bubbling. <laughs> and that's it. That is my cell. Afterwards, this will all turn clear again, and you'll be able to see all the uh, the stainless steel tubes in there. And that's it.